<laughs> Hello, this is definitely not Phil Keegan, and welcome to this year's The Amazing Christmas Race. And this year's race is no exception. So let's get started. Your first clue lies somewhere under your newly found treasure. What treasure are we referring to? Well, let's just say you have to scale many mountains of note in order to have a major impact on this minor find. I think it's a mountain challenge. Really? It might be. Wait a minute. You girls stand next to each other. We're doing the Christmas race. So it says, says, it says All of a sudden, you'll have to scale many to mountains of note in order to have a major impact on this minor find. They are so close. So what do you think? The, that would be in the calendar. Well, we can go try the calendar. Okay. Oh, are they looking for something now? Yeah, they're on their race. Well, here's our mountain shape. Where? These are our mountain challenges. Okay. But there's nothing here. Okay. So what else do you think it might be? Um. Uh, what's this roll up there? That says receipt. Oh. So scale Try many again. mountains. Just keep reading it. Scale many mountains of notes. Oh, no, probably not. <gasps> oh! Scale, notes, major, minor, piano! Of course! Hmm. Well, let's open it. Look around. to have stayed sharp even after all this time. Okay, here's the clue for the next hiding spot. Kaylin uses this much more than Jeannie and more than anyone else in the house for that matter. It's just, she really enjoys it warm and crispy once in a while. Warm and crispy. What do you really like that's warm and crispy? You like, you like mac and cheese crispy? <laughs> yeah. Really? Crispy. I've never known you to like crispy mac and cheese. Um, what's warm and crispy that you really like? I don't know what you like. And Jamie? Toast. You oh. do have more toast. Toast. Toast, toast, and toaster. Toast. <laughs> Roadblock, take a break. Uh -oh. Hug a grandma and tell her why she is so special to you. You have to be genuine because you will not get the next clue until they both agree you are. Oh, that might be it. Is that it? I think so. Now that you have connected with your grandmothers, I'm with the race. <laughs> the inventor of this device is Ken L. Much to B's dismay. The Ken L. Much to B's dismay. Ken L. And then it oh. says his last name. Kendall. Lebowitz. Kendall. Did you hear Kayla? Did you hear Kayla? Now, but he still watches them play. 
He loves making fancy breakfast for you guys and singing the song. Football! What else does he do again? Hmm. Watch football. The flag! The flag! The flag! Where does he keep the flag? Where's our next clue? Oh, hold it up in there. Well, either you were going to get that one fast or not at all. I guess you're pretty clever. Anyway, let's stop here um, for, uh, for a little while and eat some breakfast. Man, I am starving. Sticky buns and eggs, oh my. Where do you suppose you'll find the next clue? Hmm, where did you find it last time? You had to stop the race or food. We found it under one of our chairs. But you can't look until after breakfast. Tell your father and mother just how much you love them. Give them both huge hugs and kisses, and maybe, just maybe, you will get the whereabouts of the treasure you seek. It's so funny, there's so many mics around. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, I love you. I love you too. Jasmine, that's a good name. Her name is Jasmine. Dreamy, what? Dreamy, I got baby, I got baby, baby bottles. Hey, look! This was the one and it was Elsa, and I didn't realize that. I figured out her name. What? Her name is Jasmine.